You know what guys, I'm really running out of ideas to upload videos and I want to do some PS2 gameplays but I'm just not in the mood and I'm depressed as shit because I really want to do Universe Mode videos so bad but I have to wait for a certain amount of time. Hopefully I'll get it sooner than later but regardless today we're going to do a Boy123 Gym Top 5 WWE Championship Belt Designs. So without further ado, let's begin. The World Heavyweight Championship Big Goldie, the Big Gold Belt from 2002 to 2013. The World Heavyweight Championship, I remember so many memories like Jericho winning it in the Elimination Chamber back in 2010 or Edge beating John Cena at Backlash due to Big Show chokeslamming Cena through the searchlight and Jeff Hardy finally winning the World Heavyweight Championship after he was done wrong by his brother Matt Hardy at the Royal Rumble in 2009 and then you know all that time and Edge winning the world title at TLC it's so many memories Plus, I like I love how it looks you know it's big it's gold has a little has like red rhinestones I guess and it's it just like it, it makes you look like a world heavyweight champion all right so that's number five number four is the WWE World Heavy? Wait a minute, that's not the word. What the fuck? Who put this there? Who? Whose man's is this? Wait a minute, that's not. No, fix it. Three, you better fix it. Fix it. Fi fix it. That's not the World Heavyweight. Motherfucker, you better fix this shit. You got five, four, three, two, one. Okay, there we go. The WWE World Heavyweight Championship. When Brock Lesnar defeated John Cena's 2014 at SummerSlam, taking John Cena to a fetus version of Suplex City. Triple H and Stephanie McMahon just showed, just presented Lesnar with that title. That title looks beautiful as fuck. Black gold with red on it i swear titles some titles are good with red on it i swear i mean no wonder i love the old world tag team titles in the ruthless aggression era from 2003 to 2010 i think so that wwe world heavyweight championship title looks so good god damn plus so many matches so many great matches with that title plus your boy's favorite super, your boy's favorite wrestler he's not a WWE superstar he's a wrestler and AJ Styles is the current WWE World Champion. So, that's why I had to put this title on the list. Because I want the title, you know. So, I had to put it on the list. Alright, so that's number four. Number three is the first design. It's the premature design of the... WWE World Heavyweight Championship, the WWE title that The Rock made after the spin spin about. Honestly, this title I didn't like it at first. When The Rock presented it, the way how he presented it, I didn't like it, you know, because uh, it just looked dark and it looked plain. I'm like, okay, the big W and the champion, and, like, and then, but then now I look at it back, it's like that title look actually looked it looks legitimate bro it looks like it looks like what a championship should look like but like i said i, I didn't like it at first mainly because it were, i guess it was resembling to the old world tag team titles the uh, the, the current tag team titles i should say and I, I i just didn't like it you know but like i said i look back and i'm like that title it just looks good it just looks and it feels good. Plus, you know, The Rock was champ, and then Cena was champ, and then Daniel Bryan won the title, Randy Orton won the title, and then they combined the, the title with the big gold belt, and, you know, so, plus it was the first title you can change side plates, you know, so that was, that was the, uh, the first championship of, of its kind. All right, number two is the WWF. Attitude Era, Triple H, uh, or Stone Cold, or The Rock, or Undertaker, or even Kane Championship title. 
or even Vince McMahon himself. From 1998 after WrestleMania 14 to 2002 with the big gold belt when it was called the Undisputed Title, that championship, you know, it's it, it has a lot of prestige to me because, I mean, I watched a lot of Attitude Era stuff for the past year and just seeing like, people like Mick Foley win the world title like that and, you know, it had a lot of moments. I mean, you can't blame me for not putting it on this list. It had moments. It was more like a moment championship. It, it fully winning the title, even though WCW tried to screw him over by spoiling it. You have uh, Stone Cold going through McMahon's BS to win it back. You have The Rock winning it after uh, DX and Triple H's uh, antics. You have Triple H winning it so many times. You, you, re you always recognize the title around Triple H's waist and you know Vince McMahon held the title just for from the help of his, his former rival in Stone Cold so a lot of moments and a lot of history is in this championship and no one can ever forget it all right and now my number one number one WWE championship belt design is the WWE Spinner Championship. I I've been watching a lot of Sweet Life of Zack and Cody slash On Deck. Don't fuck with me. I got my Marion Mosby on. All right. Don't say a word. You're probably thinking, "Ill, no, ugly, no, disgrace, no, 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 no." I don't give a fuck. Do you want to know why I love this title so much? I didn't want to tell anyone, but I'm like, you know what? I don't give a damn about the backlash, bro. I'm just going to tell you how it is. The reason why I love the WWE Spinner Championship. Like, have you always, have you ever paid attention to what I always say when I ever talk about my first year of watching wrestling? When I first watched the WWE, that title was there. Who had the title? Um, Edge, then Triple H, then Randy Orton, and then John Cena, Randy Orton again, and then John Cena, and then Sheamus, and then John Cena, then Batista, then... He, uh, you get my point, bro. Alright, you get my point. I just remember a lot of moments with this title, plus a lot of story that came with it, alright? That's why I love this championship so much. <sighs> there, I let it out. And there you guys have it. That is my top five WWE Championship belts design. Thank you guys for sticking with me this long without Universe Mode. Universe Mode is basically my flagship content on this channel. But thank you guys for still sticking with me this long. Leave a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. And tell me what... Tell me what are your favorite WWE Championship belt designs. Leave your comments below and follow me on Twitter at Boy123Gym. And I'll see you guys next time. And I am out. Cue the outro. 3, 2, 1. We some southern boys with the promise strength. Ain't nobody man enough to feel the pain.